So today's objective, objective. Chest and more chest. Pump goal for today. Is to have the chest pump be so crazy that if we were to take something and put it in between our chest and then flex, like it immediately would shoot so fast. Like the velocity of it would turn it into a rocket. You know what I mean? It's like a meteor that's coming down. It might not be like crazy big, but the rate at which it's coming down can cause mass destruction. So the pump needs to be so good that we can put something in between here, squeeze it and get that level of destruction, which is how fast it shoots out of my big, meaty, sweaty, dripping chest. High intensity, my guys and my gals, like high intensity. Every set, not just the last one, every set should be close to failure if not to failure like you should be struggling on every set you know what i mean <sighs> like that was the fucking first set every set should be like that and also like if you're let's say like shooting for the rep range of like 8 12 whatever and you feel yourself getting closer to completing the rep range and it's still not hurting enough, don't be afraid to throw a little bit of a pause in there, you know what I mean? Or go extra slow or squeeze extra at the top. You know what I mean? Like I got to like maybe five or six and I was like, okay, I'm not really like at that intensity I wanna be at yet. And I'm only going for eight reps. So let me just really squeeze on the way down, you know, just like contract into everything, like really make it fucking hurt to the point where those last, you know, two reps, Fucking brutal, dude. afraid of that feeling chase that feeling you know what i mean like live to the point where something becomes fucking wrong with you First form, African-American breathing, heavy incline. Now that was good. 
Dude, I've gotten like too big to the point where like when shit like this happens, it's like I kind of make my own prison. <sighs> now to take it even a step further, I'm gonna take like four seconds rest, then use the absolute rest of my upper chest energy to just push this shit up. You know what I mean? Even up the breathing form. So we'll go from first form African American breathing to second form uh, black skin breathing. Probably got like a super fucking nasty pump, dude. Sometimes accessories are just kind of fucking weird to me. It's like I'll put on a weight like for accessories and it will be like way too heavy for me to do it like right. And then it's like as soon as I move it up like one, it's like too fucking light. So it's just like I need to start like making like my own weights and start bringing those into the gym. I don't know. It's a problem and it's annoying. You gonna move for me? Move nice. I was at 27 last time, so we're gonna pit on 32. Little Kev tip for the day. Go heavier than last time. First rep, I was fucking hurting, so that shit was fire. Um, it's always like a good set when you can do um, do your set, and that first rep starts hurting already, but you still manage to crank out like eight, 10, 12 reps. Like that shit always feels good, and the pump after it always feels just like <sighs> absolutely insane.
Grow my chest. My chest is kicking. My chest is kicking, but we still got work. Still got one more set. So the ultimate goal for this last set, um, I'm gonna just push it to the max. We're gonna make it feel like it's tearing without actually creating a tear in the muscle, you know? And then even if we do happen to get a tear because we push it too hard, that's like a feat, you know what I mean? It's like, I fucking push myself so hard that I just forced my muscles to tear because my body was thinking like, dude, this motherfucker Kev is crazy, pitting me through so much pain. So I'm just gonna tear myself just to get him to stop. But I believe that it won't happen and we'll have a good set. straight into doing some of these. <sighs> Come on, talk to me. Let me lift you up. Maybe for a set of some nice eight. All in all, I think the pump's valid. I got no complaints. Um, it was an all around chest day. I did not record the bench press, just decided to record the workout, but I will tell you guys that care about my compounds about that. I was thinking about doing a deload this week, decided not to. We're gonna go for one more training block before we you know, do a deload. So we went into the heavy sets of eight. Um, unfortunately, there wasn't a spotter available. Um, and I was gonna throw the video on like my Snapchat, Instagram, so I can have my cameraman give me a lift off. So we went for 325 PR for eight, and we got seven clean ones, and then kind of like hit a wall on that last one to where like if I got a lift off, I'm not trying to make excuses, but like lift offs do help. Um, but anyways, we got it like a little bit over halfway, and then we gassed out, but seven, in more than like a little bit more than a half is still a PR. So I'm still happy with that. And then we got 300 for eight, like right after 
pause reps and then 225 for eight pause reps. So in all, PR, good work for the bench press, good workout, solid pump, solid work.